the problem that you have with the predictions of the end of Moore's Law is it's really limited to the, the visual horizon that the people have. And if you notice that, you go back and you look at the people that have predicted an end of Moore's Law, Gordon himself in 1995, they're usually towards the end of their careers uh, or they've retired. They've, uh, uh, they're no longer in this, this, you know, really rush to develop technology that, that all the young people are inside these research organizations. And so they'll get up and they'll say something like, you know, it's going to end. And, and it just charges up all the, the people that are down in the ranks that are trying to figure out how to prove them wrong. Because they want to be the next ones that are standing up there and, and, and you know, because that's the road to riches is, is making this technology work.